Hello YouTubers, today I'm doing a review on the Motorola Surf 4 Extreme Modem 3.0. I got this on Amazon for $68. Uh, got it in for about in two days because I have Prime membership. Um, when I first got this, it wasn't working really great. So I was a bit confused as to whether it was my modem or it was Comcast cable line. Uh, so anyway, after a month in, because I got this on June 26, it just died. Like my internet completely died. And it stopped working. So I called Comcast and they came in and they put in new lines and the guy took out um, well, the, the cable that was coming inside the house, what well, happened was a technician before had connected three lines to it, to that, and then he put in a splitter for the modem and the cable box, and that reduces the signal significantly, and as the years went on, um, the signal gets worse and worse until it completely stopped. So what happened was when that guy took all that out and he just, uh, put a splitter directly on the cable line and then directly into my new modem. It worked awesome. Ever since then I haven't had a single interruption. Not one bit and I just did my speed test yesterday. I'm, I got around 46, 47 megabytes per second, you know, which is pretty close to the 50 that I'm paying. Uh, the second part was Comcast sack me with the technician bill, which, you know, is not my fault, it was their own fault. But anyway, I guess that's another story. Um, so in other words, this modem works really good. Um, I would give it a 5 stars. On Amazon, it got a 4.5 stars. And when I called up Comcast and talked to Albert from India, he told me that this was the most up-to-date modem and that I shouldn't have any signals, problem, issues with it. So from the Comcast on word of mouth, it's a really good modem. And I'm going, I pair this with the uh, MediaLink router and it works really great. So here, I'm going to show you what I was talking about. Right, so. I still had the box here just in case, you know, in case I had to return it because it wasn't working too well. So here's $70, um, saving me 8 bucks a month on the Comcast modem. Yeah, I just talked to Comcast about that bill they sacked me with yesterday. But anyway, I guess, like I said, that's really another story. Alright, so as you can see, um, here's my modem and it's working, yay! So here, this is the wireless part and then here's the internet signal and there's two little blue lights. Even if the lights are all green, it will still work. So, but mostly the blue lights will be on. And then here is my media link. Uh, router. I got both for around $110. And then here's what I'm I was referring to. Um, so you can see. So if your modem isn't working, I can tell you that it probably isn't its fault. It's probably Comcast. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. So as you can see, here's the cable line. This is the direct one that comes directly from outside. What happened was the guy had um, put in a little connector this big onto the end here and then he connected another line to that and then from there he connected the splitter and somehow that had reduced the signal coming in through this cable and the Comcast technician that came in a couple weeks ago had even used his device and he didn't get any signal at all. So what he did was he took all that out and he had just connected the splitter directly. Splitter directly. Here's the splitter. Sorry, it's a little dark here. Uh, the splitter here directly to the line. 
and then onto my modem and it works great so there you go five stars from me works awesome haven't had any issues ever since let's see So I guess I can throw this in a recycle now because I don't need to want to have to return this anymore. It works really great. Um, it's the most up-to-date available and it's only $68. I was going to get that $100 one, but this one works just fine. So anyways, um, that's it for my review. If you have any questions or any advice, or how to deal with Comcast, um, leave a comment and or a question and I will get to you as soon as I can. Thank you for watching. You have a great day.